at Border Paws Animal Rescue for another edition of Pet Project and this week we are inside one of the cat condos that they have and we're showcasing a few cats here today one being Duchess uh, who's a long-standing resident here and then we have Woodstock and Snoopy together <laughs> and then two other ones are hidden Bigfoot and Banshee um, and tell me a little bit about them I know you mentioned that Duchess is the longest resident here um, but tell me a little bit about their personalities and you know how old they are alrighty so yeah this is Duchess she's been in our care for 125 days she is now officially our longest resident she's about a four-year-old uh, domestic short hair very sweet cat she gets along she came in as a stray she gets along with other animals she's had no issues in any of the condos very affectionate cat I mean she would do good in any home right she's good with children um, other animals she's quite close to the dogs doesn't seem to mind the dogs at all so yeah no I think she would be a great fit and for anybody any home and then over here we got these two we got uh, they were actually left in an apartment building. Um, we believe they're from the same litter. Even though they're different colors, they look identical. So yeah, we've got Woodstock here and Snoopy. And again, get along great with kids. We had a pre-K class here yesterday. And this guy here, Woodstock, was all over all the children. So they would definitely be good with any age kids. Um, and then we've got Bigfoot. She's kind of hiding down there as well as Banshee. They're a little more standoffish, but they would do good um, I believe in any home. I mean, I don't know if they'd love kids or going at them. But, uh, yeah, no, they would do really good. And, yeah, I'm guessing these boys are about two years old and around the same age. I know Bigfoot is a little bit younger, about a year old. And now you were mentioning that Bigfoot and Snoopy are bonded, kind of a bonded pair, yes. despite not being from the same litter. There's a little love connection there going on. There definitely <laughs> is. She seems to really come out of her shell when he's around. So we would love to see them go together. Even though these guys are brothers, we'd love to see them go together too. But if somebody would want to take uh, Bigfoot with Snoopy, it would be amazing and right now we have our sale going on so it would be uh, bonded pairs are 50% off so and that's your Valentine's Day sale yes. and that's going till Tuesday right yes it goes all the way till Valentine's Day so right now it's adult cats are 50% off and then kittens and bonded pairs which we don't have a lot of bonded pairs at the moment are all buy one get one free so I know when you get a kitten you know they got lots of energy mm -hmm. so it would be nice you know if you kind of want to have a kitten to burn off its own energy get another kitten exactly it's two for the price of one it's nice you know to get two litter mates so and we've got still tons of kittens mm -hmm. uh, here at the shelter as well at PetSmart and Pet Value we are full with kittens there as well and speaking of Pet Value this weekend you have a two-day adoption event tell me a little bit about that and what people can expect so that they know when to show up and what they need to do so yeah we have it at pet value this saturday i believe the 10th and then the 11th sunday the 11th it's going to run from 12 to 5 so head on down to pet value we're going to have lots of cats there i'm not sure if we're going to have any dogs there this weekend unfortunately our dogs are all a little too crazy um but yeah no we will be there from 12 to 5 and then if you do think you're wanting to adopt i know we've talked about this before mm -hmm. we've mentioned fill out your application ahead of time you don't need to write a cat on there just head to our website fill it out and that way we can check your references and everything mm -hmm. and then you can leave that same day if you meet your forever buddy and for the Valentine's Day sale if someone because the application process does take a bit just to get the references called and stuff if someone fills out an application um, on the 14th would they still be qualified for the sale price? Yeah, we would still honor it in that case if you do decide last minute the 14th. Um, we'll also make sure we're getting on all of the applications that day, but yeah, I would definitely honor it if somebody does fill it out last minute. As long as it's filled out by the 14th, we would honor it there for you. Yes, and I must say, Duchess especially mm -hmm. is <laughs> super sweet, so she would definitely make a great addition uh, to any household. Mm -hmm. And the other, they're just chilling, <laughs> so it kind of they have kind of chill personalities and stuff uh, to mix in. So I think these cats would make great homes for absolutely really anybody. Um, and again, we ask this every week any donations that you're in need of or that you're looking for? So we are actually pretty low on cat food right now um, and wet and uh, dry. Uh, especially kitten food. We do not have a lot of kitten wet or kibble right now, so we could definitely use that. I mean, we can always use dog food too, but yeah, definitely cat food we're definitely running low on right now. 
Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining me in this beautiful cat condo. And uh, hopefully Duchess, especially since she's been here so long, uh, she finds her forever home as well, especially the other cats as well, too. <laughs> um, especially with the sale going on, yeah, too. Perfect that, time that's a to perfect get a cat. timing. Um, and yeah, so thank you so much for joining me. Thank you, guys.